Hi, I'm Vicki Flint, registered dental hygienist and plaque destroyer extraordinaire. And the name of my independent dental hygiene practice is Dental Hygiene Haven. And I welcome you to my video about gum disease. Today I'm going to talk to you about what happen happens in a gum disease evaluation. It's called probing. And the instrument that I use first is the mirror. And also this, which is a probe and looks like that. This is actually, I call it a probe, you can think of it as a tiny little ruler. And now I'm going to show you how it works. I take three measurements around each tooth, actually six around each tooth. Three around the outside here on your cheek side and then three on the inside along the tongue side. And it works like this. Now I'm going to show you with my hand how it works in your mouth. So let's just say that my hand here is a tooth and this is the root of the tooth it, and the sleeve here is gums. Now around every tooth you have an area where your gums just kind of lean up against your teeth just like this cuff leans against my wrist. Now where this stitch line is here let's just say that this sleeve is anchored or stitched right to my arm at this point. Well that coincides with your gums at a certain point down your tooth, those gums actually anchor to your teeth. So, and this mirror, or this, uh, yeah, this mirror handle, let's say now that it's a probe, see I have a couple of identification bands on here, and this will represent the first marking on the probe. So this area to here is three millimeters. Now here's how probing works. First I'm going to go around, just slip it right down the long axis of your tooth, like this, until I bump into this stitch line at the bottom. That's why it feels kind of pokey sometimes. I do have to find where your gums attach to your tooth. And so right here is three millimeters, and that's a good number, by the way. The healthy numbers are zero, one, two, or three. If you have four or more, we'll talk about that in a minute. So we go around, we take a measurement, and I will be calling off to my computer three, two, three, these are, these are good numbers. Now let's say that we're going along taking all these measurements, all of a sudden we sink clear down here. This would be like seven. That's not very good. And we will talk about why. When you brush your teeth, tooth brushing removes plaque from your teeth as you know. Now if you could peel your gums back, what you would see is that even though the gums here lean up against your teeth, plaque actually does form on your tooth even though the gums lean up against there. So these leaning gums do not keep plaque from forming on your teeth, not at all. So when you brush your teeth, you need to be angling your toothbrush bristles gently up into against your gum line and when you do little tiny scrub circle motion uh, up for your upper teeth and angle down for your lower teeth. So then what happens is those toothbrush bristles get right up underneath here and sweep the plaque right out of there. Unfortunately, toothbrushing only removes about 70% of plaque. That's why we are always harping on flossing. Flossing gets the other 30% here in between the teeth where you're more prone to get gum disease in the first place. So with proper brushing and flossing, you're getting underneath this cuff around each and every one of your teeth, sweeping all the plaque out of there, staying ahead of it, preserving your awesome smile. Now I mentioned what happens if this is four or more. Let's say we said seven. Well that means that you're clear down here before that stitch line actually anchors. You've got all this space for plaque to be forming. Your toothbrush is not going to reach there, neither is floss. In that situation, you and I will be talking about some specialized things that you can do at home to get on top of this and get rid of that, hopefully. We'd like to reverse that, see your body reverse that. So, that's the demonstration about gum disease. That's how it works. That's why brushing and flossing is important. And you need to call me today with your questions. 970-204-0227. Thanks for joining me. This is Vicki Flint, registered dental hygienist and plaque destroyer extraordinaire at Dental Hygiene Haven, signing off. Till next time.